Hello there, everyone. So I'm here with Ingrid. Hello. Miss <laughs> um, so Ingrid, tell them what are we doing here today? We are doing the PLL, aka Pretty Little Liars tag, mm -hmm. and Joey and I came up with a bunch of questions that we thought would be cool, like relating to the show. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we have seven questions that we're going to be doing on my channel, seven on hers, um, so you can watch that after. Um, but anyways, let's get on to the questions. Oh, wait. What? We have to warn them. Spoilers. If you're not caught up on the show, we might be giving away some spoilers, so just like kind of keep that in mind. Yeah. We'll, we'll um, tell you before the question if it's a spoiler. Yeah, if we're about to like say something or like if the question itself has a spoiler in it. So, mm -hmm. we'll let you know. Mm -hmm. And by the way, Pretty Little Liars is a CW show if you guys didn't know. ABC Family. What? I thought it was CW. ABC Family. It is? Yes. <laughs> Wow, you learn something new every day. It's an ABC Family show, everyone. CW. Wow. Not a big fan, apparently. <laughs> well, actually, first of all, I want to just talk about the fact that, like, what did these girls do? That I know. was so bad like, to deserve it. Why, for years, is A, like, going after them? Like, I don't understand. The they all seem like really sweet, nice girls, and they've shown, like, past, like, clips of them when Allison was alive. Yeah. Like, they were nice. Yeah. Allison was the biatch. Like, like why? Like, and she's gone apparently. Yeah. So why are they like involved in everything? I don't understand. I just don't <gasps> see what they did. So that's kind of one of the reasons why we're making this tag, so we can kind of get like a discussion going mm -hmm. with you guys. But let's get on to the first question. Number one, who's your favorite character? Oh, this is hard. I really like Spencer. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just go with Spencer. I I really like Spencer too, but as much as I like Spencer, I always like gravitate more towards Arya. I really yeah, I just, why I can't help it. I just her story is boring. But I don't know. I just like Arya as a character. I like her artsiness and yeah stuff like that. But I like the actress that plays Spencer, and I think Spencer is like. I don't know, she's kind of like the center, like the brains of the She operation. really is. She she knows when something's up. The other girls are just stupid. She she figures things <laughs> out. She does. Like they'd be so lost and they so would. stupid without They would be totally lost without Spencer. So yeah. it's kind of like a tie for me between Spencer and Arya. Okay. Number two, who do you think is behind the A team? Hmm. Well, this is like my theory, and I've actually talked to people who've read the books and they're like, did you read the book? So I don't know if this was right or whatever, but I think you agree with me on this, yeah. that we think that Allison had a twin sister mm -hmm. because in the Halloween episode, Allison was telling a story to this person that she was babysitting. She's like, oh, there used to be these two girls and one, one sister killed the other one. So I think that was like a foreshadow of like her actual life. So Yeah. I... I don't know, I feel like Allison or like a twin possibly is like somehow involved with like the A-team. Yeah. Um, I feel like they haven't revealed. Yeah, because they yet. keep showing this woman in like a red coat with blonde hair, which they were trying to like pull it off as it was Cece, but yeah. it's it's not Cece. It's Allison They wanna Swinton. shock us, so that's why I'm like, what are they yeah. gonna do? I'm really hoping that it's not Allison Swinton's sister because that I don't know. I just feel like that's kinda obvious now. I don't know. Especially if you've read the books, I guess, too. Yeah, which I haven't. So number three, who do you ship? <gasps> Ooh This is a good one. Yeah. <laughs> um well if you are caught up with this season, I would say Arya and um her, what's his birthday? Oh, the brother, Wes. Wes, which is, what's his face, his brother? Mr. Fitz. Mr. Fitz. <laughs> um, Slash Ezra. Ezra, right. <laughs> um, so I ship them. Well, I'm gonna ship me and Ren. <laughs> no, 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 no. And you can't ship yourself into that. All right, okay. So, um, who do I ship? I kind of like Ren and Spencer. I know that like all the to oh, yeah. like all the Toby and Spencer people, like they I feel like people really love Toby and Spencer together and I, I did like I, I didn't. I never liked it. I knew something was it, up from Toby it, from the beginning. It kind of grew on me, but I don't know, I just always felt like there was something between Spencer and Ren. Yeah. So I was always like kind of 
hoping for I that. I know. Although I felt bad for Melissa, her older sister. I know. Because she like. She's so bad. She stole like, it. Like the beginning of the series, it was when they were revealing all of that stuff. Yeah. I was like, ooh, <laughs> Spencer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Most memorable, cheesy slash stupid moment in the show. Oh, I have a good one. The the whole show is full of cheesy <laughs> stupidness, but it's that's what like. It draws you in. Yeah. It's good. But there was a part where Emily and Paige were driving to a party in the woods. <laughs> Who in high school has a party in the woods? And then they stop the car and they're like, I'm really scared. Like, I'm just so afraid. And oh, I remember this. And then they get out of the car and they're like, well, maybe we should go for a walk in the woods. Were we watching this together? Because we were I don't, I don't think so. Because I remember watching that and being like, what the heck? Doing. Like if you're scared, <laughs> stay in the freaking car or drive back to town. Don't get out of your car and walk around. It's like freaking scary movies when it's like, oh, what's that noise? Let's go look for yeah. it. <laughs> it made no sense to me. So I'd be like, let's get out of here. Yeah. Let's go get some frozen yogurt or right. something. No, let's go for a walk in the woods in the middle of the night and then come back to find like our tires were splashed and then run after whoever did that. Oh my god. No, makes no sense. What about you? Well, this isn't really like in the storyline of the show, but what I think is super cheesy is um, when something will happen in the show and when you're watching it live, like the hashtags will come up on TV. I've never seen And some those. of the hashtags that they come up with are just so funny. I tweeted about this last week when the show was airing and I was like, you gotta love those cheesy hashtags from Pretty Little Liars because some of them are just... They're just, yeah. they're really good, oh. so I enjoy those. Next one, favorite villain. Ooh, favorite villain. I think maybe Jenna was my favorite villain. She was good. I kind of forgot about Jenna. Yeah, she's gone. Actually, you know what? I kind of like Mona more. Yeah, I love, Mona's my favorite. Yeah. I think, I think the actress, um, Janelle, I forget her last name, but I think she does a fantastic job just pulling off Mona. She started off being like, kind of like this snobby girl and then went crazy and now she has like the crazy but trying to like be nice yeah. girl thing going on and even like her wardrobe has changed and I just, I think she does a great job playing Mona. I this girl, I can't tell if she's actually good deep yeah. down or what her angle is, but I mean, I, I can't believe that she's like fully bad. I know, I feel like, I feel like she really does care about Hannah. Yeah. yeah. And I don't know, I feel like there's something else like going on. So I don't know yeah. if Mona is like fully like as bad. I don't know. I don't yeah. know though. Who do you predict will or might become a villain? I think, I mean, it's kind of already been alluded to this, but Melissa, Spencer's older sister, she's had a lot of past with Allison and stuff, and I just think she's bad. Like, she definitely has something to do with Allison's death, and I think it's gonna come out. Yeah, it definitely seems like she's hiding something. Yeah. So. Although her character was gone for a while, but I think it's because she was shooting vampires. Yeah, <laughs> totally. <laughs> Um, I hate saying this because I love Ezra, but I kind of feel like they might make Ezra into a bad guy just because his storyline is very like a good. Side, it's like a side story too. Yeah, like, and it has it's, nothing to it's do with just them. kind of like, I don't know, they just portray him as like this really nice guy, sometimes maybe like overly nice to the point where you wouldn't really... Yeah. Is expect that he would do something bad, so that just kind of makes me think that maybe he is right. Like, and also, crazy. like, what's the whole point of her and his relationship? Yeah. Like, I don't know. I feel like maybe he could be involved with like the NAT club or something like that because it seems like he's around the same age as like Melissa, and, right? Like that group of people. So I don't know. I there's That's like a million true. things that like go through my head with that. And the last one, which girl do you think has been hurt the most by A? Um, definitely not Arya. Definitely not Arya. <laughs> she has it so easy. She gets off scot-free in that show. Seriously, I think that's else. why like, I don't like Arya as much as the other girls because she, she's just off doing her own thing. She's like not even part of them. She's probably like, when they all get the text, she probably doesn't even get them. She just pretends. She's like, oh, I got, I got that too, guys. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> 
Like, she's not even in it. The only thing that A has really done to Arya, it seems like, is try to like get between her and Ezra and maybe right. like a little bit involved in well, her family drama. Remember the Halloween episode this time she got put in that crate and was getting oh, yeah. pushed out? So that was the only bad thing that happened to her. But if you compare it to like Emily and Spencer. Yeah, they definitely have had it the worst. Yeah, like. I would go more Spencer, but that's because I really don't like Emily as much. Okay, like spoilers. So if you're not like fully caught up, like. Emily lost Maya, yeah, and that was like really hard. But right. like Toby and Spencer and that whole thing that happened, so it's that's true. I I feel like with Spencer and Toby, it's a little bit different. Yeah, I, I feel like that was more. They had more of a story than Maya and Emily did, so yeah. you feel more connected to that. I know. And you can kind of like feel for Spencer. Yeah. So she's turning crazy right now. I know. Though, I so. love it though. I I'm loving the crazy Spencer. Yeah. I I know that if I was playing Spencer, I would enjoy. She has the like, best character. Yeah. Like she's smart. I don't know she's got to play. I kind of feel roles. like maybe Spencer is like pretending to be crazy. <gasps> But I like that theory. <laughs> yes, because I like Spencer and. I feel like Spencer would do something like that. To like get the information to, that she to wants. To throw A off. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, hmm. those are the questions for this half of the tag. Better go continue on to Ingrid's channel and watch the rest. Yep, we have seven more that we'll be doing and we'll be talking more about like style and just more talking about the show. Yeah. So, so head on over. <laughs> that's where we'll be. <laughs> And if you like this video, <laughs> make sure to give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys tomorrow. May the old be ever in your favor. Good Goodbye. Bye. And none of this is actually happening. Oh my god, can you imagine at the end of this, they're like, surprise, it was all a dream. We're like, what? Or they were dead no. the time. <laughs> like, lost. Yeah. Spoiler, sorry. It's all Allison's <laughs> dream. Yeah. I would be like, what in the 